this tree here, me experiment something by myself. As you plant, 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 you just gain a little more experience, you know. So we turn this cassava stick different. This is our Suriname stick and that one guy on a stick. So we want to haul and see what's going on. Experiment stick. Me not best, you know. But I try hard. By the grace of God, thank God for you for me. God great, you know. Let's see what's going on you now. This is this is a need for high mark. That's what's going on here. High mark there, that's what's going You don't see what's going on here. Once a man plant, you know, a man got to reap. God will help you, boy. Anybody what you do, God will help you. What's up, man? I tell you, people, I can manage them. So, you know, I'm stick this. Yeah. Back here. You see? What's up, man? What's up, man? What's up, man? I broke. I think that bull is going to be a good one. What do you mean? That's it, boy. That's it. Experiment. This is called experiment. This is a blessing, God. Thank you, my God. Thank you. Thank you for everything you give me, watch. One root. I never see something in my life like this, but I feel so happy. I'm going to start with a I'm going to get this one. 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 I'm going I've been a day. Let me see what one need for. Let me kill the one alone. Many people let me see what one. Guy, I'm not stick not ready yet, man. A guy, I'm not stick not ready yet. My dear sir, people, you see what going on? You see what going on? God great, boy. Big up yourself. Thank you, Father. Watch. One root cassava, buddy. How you go wrong here, boy? Eh? How you go wrong here? You never see something like this in the barn life here, watch. Watch what going on here, people. Blessing, God. Blessing. And watch. You see what going on eh? I'm going to show you that when it's a beer. You squash. Everything, everything. This is a guy in a stick. Yeah, man. Yeah, buddy. What's going on eh? Squash it till the top there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But that's so. One well, love, man. Respect. <laughs> Caught in the act, fridge and trash dumped in East Bank Demerara. What you need to know. Imagine waking up to find a pile of someone else's trash, an old fridge, junk, and waste, right in your neighborhood. Well, that's exactly what happened in Farm New Housing Scheme on East Bank Demerara, where one person was caught red-handed dumping garbage. Today, we are diving into this story, 
and why illegal dumping is more than just an eyesore. We encourage you to share your thoughts on this developing story in the comments section below. If you have any new stories you'd like to share, message us on WhatsApp. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more updates on this and other breaking news stories. Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, we are talking about an incident that's raised eyebrows across East Bank Demerara. Just this Friday, a driver in a vehicle with the license plate GAH2798 was reportedly caught dumping an old fridge and other items in a secluded part of the farm new housing scheme. This kind of behavior has real consequences, not only for the community, but for the environment as well. Police are now actively searching for the driver, and authorities are putting the spotlight on illegal dumping. Let's break down what happened, why it matters, and what actions are being taken. Let's start with the details of the incident. Witnesses saw the driver pull up in what looked like a quiet corner of the farm new housing scheme. This wasn't just a case of littering, they left behind an old refrigerator along with other items, treating a public area as a private dump site. For local residents, this is a major frustration. Not only is it unsightly, but it feels like a violation of their community space. People in the area have spoken out, worried about the growing trend of illegal dumping that disrupts their efforts to keep the neighborhood clean and safe. Now, let's talk about why illegal dumping is a big deal. It might seem harmless to just leave trash on the roadside or in a quiet area, but the impact is huge. Old appliances like refrigerators contain harmful chemicals that can leak into the soil, causing pollution that harms wildlife, contaminates water sources, and even poses risks to human health. And it's not just an environmental issue, it affects property values and can create a cycle where one act of dumping encourages others to leave their waste, turning the area into an unregulated dump site. Our communities deserve better than this. Illegal dumping isn't just irresponsible, it's illegal. The authorities are cracking down on these actions with clear penalties in place. In cases like this, where there's evidence of a license plate, police are actively pursuing the driver, who could face serious fines or even legal charges. Law enforcement and local authorities are stepping up their efforts to protect the community and the environment from this kind of neglect. And for residents, it's a step towards keeping their neighborhood clean, safe, and respected. Incidents like this are a reminder of how important it is to keep our communities clean and to respect the shared spaces we all rely on. Illegal dumping doesn't just look bad, it can have lasting impacts on the environment and the people who live nearby. By taking a stand, reporting incidents, and supporting stricter enforcement, we can help build a cleaner, healthier community. Desperate plea, mother of eight needs life-saving brain surgery, time is running out. What you need to know. Imagine being told you have a life-threatening condition, but have no way to access the surgery that could save your life. This is the heartbreaking reality for Leslyn Richmond, a mother of eight from Sophia, who is now racing against time. We encourage you to share your thoughts on this developing story in the comments section below. If you have any new stories you'd like to share, message us on WhatsApp, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more updates on this and other breaking news stories. Back to our channel. Today, we bring you a story of urgent need and resilience. Leslyn Richmond, a 39-year-old mother, recently received life-shattering news, a brain aneurysm diagnosis. This condition has already taken the sight in one of her eyes and poses an even greater threat if left untreated. Unfortunately, Georgetown Public Hospital doesn't have the facilities to perform the surgery she needs, and going private means she now faces a $6 million medical bill. A daunting amount for anyone, especially a mother fighting for her life. Leslin's life was turned upside down just months ago, with the aneurysm diagnosis. Since then, her health has steadily worsened, affecting her vision and leaving her with immense anxiety about the future. As a mother of eight, 
the youngest of whom is only eight years old, her primary concern is being there for her children. But with one eye already blind, her condition is a ticking clock, and the need for surgery is immediate and urgent. The cost of her surgery alone is close to $6 million, not even accounting for the post-surgery and aftercare expenses. Leslin's family is doing everything in their power to raise the funds, but with time running out, it's simply not enough. This is where community support becomes essential, as every contribution, no matter the size, brings her one step closer to life-saving treatment. Leslin's friends and family have started reaching out, and there may be local fundraisers and efforts underway. Yet, with the steep costs involved, they still need more help. This is a moment when we as a community can make a difference. A few dollars from each of us could mean Leslin's children get their mother back, healthy and hopeful. If you feel moved to support Leslin and her family in this difficult time, please reach out to them directly at plus 592-610-5429. Every bit of support counts, and sharing this video can help her story reach more people who might be willing to help. Thank you so much for watching. Please share this video and spread Leslin's story to help her family raise the funds they desperately need. With that said, thanks for watching, and until next time.